film the video. I'm here with Alberta Angling. This is Reese and Luke. What's going on? So yeah, we're headed out to Lake Wobbleman. We're gonna fish at a site. Uh, it's called Phallus Point, and we'll kind of show you on the GPS where that is. Uh, gonna set up the tent, set up a couple tip-ups, and see how it goes today. We're rolling in here. Woo! We're finally here set up. It's raining outside. Yeah, let's get to some fishing. Time to get to it. Not a lot of action right now, I can tell you that much. Yeah. drop off, eh? Quite steep, if you look back. All right, so we had absolutely zero luck in our original location. Uh, and drill a couple new holes, go a little bit deeper and see. Uh, it's pretty abnormal at Wobbleman to not have any type of bite. Uh, but you can see that the weather's a lot nicer now. Alright guys, so, tent set up over there. We're going to be moving a bit, I drilled a couple holes shallower here. And we're going to be setting some trip ups for some old pike here. So. Okay, so tip up number one, as you can see here, I can get this untangled. A few moments later. Alright guys, so on tip up number one, we're running double treble like this, with an elastic in the middle, and 50 pound fluoro. We're going to be running a big anchovy here. Something like that. And so what you do with this rig... Is you shove it through the elastic there. go. Now you got horizontal sitting presentation just like that. Okay, so second tip up right here. Probably about three feet deep down there. I don't know if it'll hold pike, but we'll find out. So we got both tip ups all set up. Let's head back to the tent. We're gonna give it a try a little bit deeper. I'm thinking deep is the way to go. It's kind of coming on afternoon here, so fish might have pushed off. Oh, a little cold out here. Probably should head back in. Let's take a peek at these tip ups. Hey, what do you do when the tip-up flag is up, bro? Yeah. Bro. Yeah. No. Is it actually? Yeah. Let's go, let's go. It's an emerald. Let's see it. Bring it home, bring it home. What? How did it go off? Maybe just the wind. 
Well, that's pretty sad. False alarm. Well, not super successful. So where are we headed to now? It's just over the lake and you just pull into the lot here. It's like, just, oh, maybe there's a little bit. Of yeah. What's the name? East Pit. East Pit. Hey, east. All right. Let's get out there. I, I did, did it without it. one. You know that time? Oh, who doesn't? It's gotta be good fishing right now if there's still so many people there. Right? <laughs> oh, there's an outhouse. Lucky you. Oh my. Did I? Just do what you gotta do. Do you have TP? In my bag. Let's turn off the camera for this. I don't know, I think it's funnier with it running. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go on ahead, you don't have to wait around. Yeah, I'm gonna scout up ahead. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, take a look at this shitter right here. Oh my God. I wouldn't wash my socks in that. Reese, come check this out, man. <laughs> oh, not nice. Nope. Okay, I need a mat, though. What? We didn't bring anything we needed. <laughs> Such an idiot. When we left, I'm like, this is definitely not all the good. All right. Okay, what's going on, Angler? We're all set up here at the trout pond. Surprisingly deep here. It's only about 10 feet deep here, considering that's your shoreline. Reese is set up over there. Oh, I'm feeling something. Yeah. Deep? Yeah, baby. Woo. First fish. A little rainbow. He's putting up quite the fight here. Let's have a look at this bad boy. Get just in the top of the mouth there. The power bait, Reese. Power bait. All right. All right, show them to me here. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Look up. Beauty, little trout. Beauty. Put them down. Oh. Oh. There you go. That was embarrassing. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, we're just dropping back down here. See if we can get another little guy. Maybe a big guy, we'll see. All right. So, how I caught that fish was I was just giving it a little, just giving it a little tick, tick, tick kind of on the spot and then just let it sit. Kind of bouncing on the spot, and then just let it sit for them to inhale it. I'll let you know if I get another one. So you guys missed it, but I just missed one. It gave me a big tug on my line when I was chicken it, and he's gone now. So I'm gonna try and rebait. See if I can get one here. Power bait gone. So, just grab a little pinch of power, the power bait there.
shouldn't be laughing at him. He's the only one that's had a bite here. Did you get that on video? I sure did. All right. So we're back in the car. Back in the car, we had one trout. Uh, yeah, and a whole lot of nothing cold wind. A pretty small baby rainbow trout. Pretty small. I missed another one. Gave me a good tug, took my bait, and he's gone. So, yeah, tough day on the water for Luke and Reese today. Uh, at least we didn't get skunked, that's all I can say. Yeah, so we'll try again uh, pretty soon in the coming weekend, but uh, I'll see you guys tuned. later. Get crazy.